<sighs> Let's be real, dog. We both knew that this day was gonna come. What is going on, guys? Etika from the oh wait. <laughs> Etika from the Etika World Network here. Etika FRFX, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Ever since Twitter back in October decided to be all like, This man isn't black! What? I was kind of stuck in like a grind. Remember when I talked to you guys about how I was working really hard to find a place? Well, as you can see, I'm in a completely new surrounding. I found a place! Yay! And I can do my thing in here uninhibited. Yay, nigga! And I can swing my dick around the apartment, no questions asked. I've marked every single square inch of this apartment. If any of my friends come over to visit, just know, dog, you probably interacted with my nuts at some point. Um, this channel has almost 200,000 subscribers as I'm seeing this right now. I respect you guys not just for coming over, but also for being patient. I sort of dwell a lot on details and I want things to be packaged how I do and I like to work at the at the pace that I do it takes a lot of patience to be an ethical world network viewer subscriber or whatever the fuck you are even though I know my policy is always like I do what I want you guys do what you want but at the same time morally speaking you guys did wait a long time a lot of people thought I wasn't passionate about it anymore and I can understand considering how long it's been to those guys who really were waiting I want to say a thank you and I want to give a slight apology because you know it, it, I, I kind of keep to myself but there's a reason for that man my mommy always taught me that I Actions speak louder than words. So I figure I'm just gonna put my head down, be humble, and work my ass off to get what I need so that way I can produce the content that I feel proud of, man. And unlike your other favorite YouTubers out here who are making flat earth theory videos and ejaculating on their cats, I promise to never do any of those things. At worst, maybe just burn a nigga alive accidentally on camera. Considering YouTube and content creation is my shit, I've been in the laboratory training. Time is now, boys. I've not had my own personal space really in a very long time to produce content, probably since 2012 or 13. I've always had roommates or a relationship or living with my mommy, who by the way, I love you dearly, mommy. Thank you for dealing with my bullshit and shenanigans for the last year and a half. <laughs> well, speaking of moms, did you see what happened to EE? E? <laughs> Listen, I can cook in the kitchen and I can eat some ass too, okay? Excuse me? Yo, what? What's up? I'm streaming! I now can produce what I want to. And with this new channel, with this fresh start, it's like a new channel, new me, new place, new everything. I'm ready to move forward in ways that I never could before. Video content will be continuing, but also regular streams. Now, there still ain't gonna be no schedule. That's always been a constant. That'll never change, okay? You get what you get when you get it. But I can say for a fact it'll be far more consistent. And there's a long laundry list of titles that I've been dying to get into that I've not had the fucking time to before until now. Games like uh, Sonic 2006, Mother 3, Metal Gear Solid, Nier Autonoma, the soundtrack in that one, that's a big one on my list. Final Fantasy 15, which I had already done like a little bit of progress on, I need to catch up with that game. No More Heroes on the Switch, Persona 5, which hopefully comes to the Switch. Hadamari Damacy, a weird ass game from back in the day. Devil May Cry, the new shit with that nigga Nero, and of course, Super Smash Brothers. Because of, there's so many of you niggas that I need to start embarrassing out here, especially now that my mane is in full effect, dogs. I, I, I'm gonna be the world's sickest Ridley, okay? Mark my fucking words. If you don't believe me, guess what? They didn't They didn't believe Edison. They didn't believe Einstein, okay? So, I don't want to hear it, dogs. If you want to keep completely updated on streams, my social medias, man, the IG and the Twitter, over there, I'll be announcing whenever I do, like, more low-key streams from now on. And by low-key, I mean potentially doing shit that...
we wouldn't want necessarily on the surface of the channel. If somehow these streams always spiral completely into madness. But if you want to keep up, the bell's right there. Hopefully this shit will work. What kind of content exactly will I be making? That's up for me to decide and you guys to just wait and see. But I'm excited either way to move forward. And I know you guys are probably excited to have me back. Maybe. I mean, who knows? Maybe you didn't miss me. Maybe you're seeing this and you're like, oh, actually, I don't like him anymore. Unsub. Hopefully not, though. <laughs> either way, guys, thank you once again. And I'll be seeing you very, very shortly. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.